Today I want to talk about the old variety from my collection, Rusbel, or it is also called Kishmish Mirage. In conditions Vitebsk region, in my vineyard, it ripens closer to mid-September. Middle load on the bush, in my conditions, on my two-plane trellis, I keep order 30 to 40 shoots. Resistance to diseases at a very high level. Shows reliable results in open field. Hello dear friends colleagues. Today we have September 9th in our yard. I want to invite you again to the vineyard and talk about an old variety from my collection, Rusbel, or something else called Kishmish Mirage, which shows stability and results in my area. And so, let's get started. This variety bred at the All-Russian Research Institute of Viticulture and Winemaking named after Potapenko in the city of Novocherkask, together with Bulgarian breeders. His parents have Villar Blanc on Supreme Seedless. This is a table soft seeded variety of early maturity. Ripening about 115-125 days. In the conditions of the Vitebsk region in my vineyard, it ripens closer by the middle of September. It has rather large bunches weighing 400-600 grams and even more, moderately dense, even I would say loose clusters themselves. Berries are seedless. They have 3-4 class perpetuity, then there are rudiments, weighing 2-2.5 grams, white are so transparent oval in the sun with brown tan, and gain good sugar. The bushes are medium vigorous, extremely productive. The laying of the crop goes up to 3 inflorescences per fruitful shoot. It is prone to crop overload, with this even throws out a lot of ovaries and crumbles, therefore, mandatory rationing is necessary, then there is a removal of excess inflorescences and poorly developed shoots. The average load on the bush in my conditions on my two flat trellis, I keep about 30 to 40 shoots with a vine trimming length of 3 to 5 kidneys. It is worth emphasizing again that this variety is very fond of short pruning and very high fruitfulness at the base of the shoots, which is its undoubted advantage in the northern regions. Of the features for growing this variety, I would note that, as for any seedless variety on large inflorescences, it is desirable before flowering remove the ends of the inflorescences, which will significantly improve both the presentation of the bunches and the berries will be more look solid. The variety is also responsive to treatment with growth stimulants at the very end. Flowering. For this you can use the ovary, bud, and also gibberellic acid, which also increases the marketability of these bunches. There is a slight tendency to cracking berries. Well, as you can see, everything is fine in my vineyard, there are no questions for him. Aging annual growth is good. Disease resistance at a very high level, but prevention, as you understand, is still necessary in the form of two or three sprays before blossoming, after blossoming and in the period of filling of berries. The variety has increased frost resistance at the level minus 25 degrees, but still requires shelter for the winter. Its main use in our family is getting great raisins. Like any seedless variety, it is an excellent pollinator for varieties with a functionally female type of flower, as it has a fairly long flowering and produces a lot pollen. Summing up, I would like to note that Rusbel shows reliable results in the open soil, but as you understand, with a wall on a vineyard, but also in other regions of Belarus. This is a summary of what I wanted to tell you. I hope the video was interesting and useful. Subscribe to the channel. Bet likes. Vadim Tachalin was with you. Until we meet again.